Okay, so what's up guys? It's Desdemona back again. So today I'm going to be doing a baddie makeup look. Um, how to look like a baddie. I'm not a baddie at all. That's why this is a transformation because this ain't doing it. So I'm going to be attempting to transform myself into a baddie. I don't really want to talk too much. So I just ate so many tacos. My stomach is rumbling. It's really not, but like I'm still hungry. So first thing we're going to do is wash our face. Um, I haven't washed my face in like two days. I've washed my face like five times this whole break and this is gonna be my sixth. So, let's do it. So I forgot to mention that this video is actually being sponsored by Poshmark so thank you Poshmark if you're watching this. So be sure to click the link in the description box to download the free app Poshmark and stay till the end to see what I'm gonna be selling on the Poshmark app. We're gonna put on some contacts in five, one. Wow. Okay, so it's like 30 minutes later. Um, I just like put them on and then I was just doing my own thing in my own world, you know? So now, for the time we've all been waiting for, we're gonna go wash our face now. Yay. Wow, the lighting, so angelic. It was awkward. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna... Oh my God. I love that my camera almost just RIP'd in the chat. My clutch doesn't have a head. All close and personal. Something that I do is I like exfoliate my lips with a toothbrush. You probably think it's weird if you don't do it, but I do this like on a regular basis, so I thought that I would just tell you, I guess. So I just like exfoliate them. It just like gets all the crust and nasty. Okay, so, oh, also I got some like new poster sh Shall I show you? I want to show me and my boyfriend. It's Tyler the Creator. And I got this little print from an art, like, person on Instagram. Her name's Sincerely Art. This is also by her. I got, like, the 8 by 10 or something. It's really small, and I hate it. I wish I knew how small it was, but... So, my face wash is still on my face. I don't know if you could tell. But, but I usually leave my face wash on until it dries. I don't know. It's just something that I've always done, like, with anything. I just feel like the face wash doesn't really work if I just put it on and then, like, take it off. I let it sit for, like... Five to ten minutes. I got this Vanity Planet like brush thing for your skin. I had one of these before, but it like stopped working. I think it's because I used it in the shower and like water got inside of it and it looked so nasty. Like where you put the batteries in, it was disgusting. But like stopped working and then I threw it out eventually. But like every time I open the little thing to put the batteries in, like on this new one, it won't open. So I don't know what's the issue. Okay, why am I sweating? It is like unnecessarily hot in here. I'm gonna close my window. I don't really like how dark it is though. Cute. So like I said, this is gonna be like a baddie. I'm gonna open my window, it is so hot in here. Let's use yellow. Um, I'm gonna use these just to pin back my hair. Okay, so I'm thinking that I'm gonna do, okay, so I'm thinking that I'm gonna do my, can my what? Thinking that I'm gonna do my eyebrows off camera so that maybe I can do like a separate video on that because I don't do my eyebrows like often but I do them sometimes, you know? I really wanna like hurry up and finish this so I can take pictures. The sun's been going down at like four, so it's kind of difficult. This is the Kiehl's Ultra Face Cream. How cute of her. This is my favorite moisturizer ever. And I'm gonna use some Vaseline so that my lips. I'm gonna use my Mario Badescu. Mmm, do I really? Okay, so I'm gonna use the Real Techniques Beauty Blender. I remember I used to think like having like the actual Beauty Blender was so important. Like if you didn't have it, you were just, you were broke. <sighs> now I'm broke. I 
I'm wearing the Irish Beauty Glam Grey Contacts, so in case anybody wants to know. I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing eyeshadow today. If I do, okay, so in order to be a baddie, you have to have hoops. It's really, it's not up for negotiation. You just have to. Um, and if you don't, you're kind of like not, so. Step is very necessary, so you just can't miss it, so. So I'm really like not having the best of skin days. Oh, I see my mom. Like, I don't mean to zoom in, but today isn't a good day. Yeah, Mother Nature decided to take a visit on me. She was not messing around. Um, my new background, like, I don't know why. It's just like, it's a mood. <laughs> you know. I'm gonna do my eyebrows and I'll be back. Okay, so I finished my eyebrows. They look really weird to me. Um. Fun. These are the batty brows. Um, I actually used, used my Anastasia Eyebrow Powder Duo. I was gonna use my dip brow, but then I thought I really am not good at doing that. So, so yeah, I suck at doing my eyebrows. We all been knew this. So let's just move on, shall we? I just got a new professional and I'm so happy about it because it's my favorite primer. I'm putting this everywhere, you know? Even on places we don't have pores because why would we do that? We just gotta smooth out this canvas, you know? Okay, so now this is the part where you would wear foundation. I'm not gonna be wearing foundation because that is my literal pet peeve. Like, we are gonna be wearing concealer. But this is like the part where you would wear foundation because like any other human being, but except I have a phobia. Just recently got the Born This Way, like full coverage, multi-use, sculpting, jingling. So, so it just looks like this. She's kind of thick. She's kind of dark as well, so. Oh, this is dark. I don't look that dark. Wow. I used this in like a year, so it's probably expired and I'm probably gonna break out and then I'm gonna be so mad that I use this and I'm never gonna wear foundation again. Healthy foundation by Physicians Formula. This is so like old and it's like really yellow tinted. You can't see it on the camera, but. Oh, this is really white. Okay, so I think I'm gonna mix this. So I think I'm gonna like, wow, designs. I don't like putting foundation on my forehead, so I'm just not going to. I'm gonna mix it with the Born This Way. Then I'm gonna put it on the back of my hand because I hate putting like foundation directly on my nose because it, it's not cute. This is kind of a good match. I hate putting foundation right here because like I have a scar right there so it like builds up around there. It is disgusting. Wow, beautiful. I don't know why like my forehead is like the place I like least want to put foundation and that's where I have a volcano. Oh, that's right. She's been attempted to be covered. Wow, this is like hurting my arm. Like I never knew how much work this is. I don't do the girls that wear makeup every day because I could never. This is like, my arm is dead. But this Awago, it's like the revolution luxury baking powder in banana. So that sounds pretty interesting. Oh, it's not opened. Okay, so there's like a seal right there, but I don't know like where it is. So. On the back of my hand. How cute. So I think I did it right. I don't know if I snapped on this one. Okay, so now for bronzer, Too Faced, Chocolate Soleil, and regular chocolate, I think. This is my favorite bronzer. This smells like good because it smells like chocolate, but low key it smells like expired, like off brand Cocoa Pebbles. Got a bunch of new Morphe brushes and I'm so happy. So I'm gonna get my MAC Fix Plus. This is the coconut one. Oh, ew. Okay, I'm like glowing. There's like a bunch of people talking outside my window. My window is open so you can hear everything that's going on. I need to like hurry so I can take pictures. 
So this is the Max Fix Plus. I've seen a lot of people do this, but I never tried it. So I'm gonna use the Anastasia Sun Dip Glow Kit, and I'm just gonna take and I'm gonna take these two. Oh. I actually like doing my makeup now, like. Okay, I'm also gonna take some of this because you can never have too much highlight. I wanted to film all day, but I waited like this specific time so that I can like get the lighting, you know? I always film at like the worst time of the day and it's so ugly. I'm gonna do like a really basic eyeshadow look, so I'm gonna be using the Modern Renaissance because I wanna make it really realistic, like some of the looks I'd be doing. I feel like a lot of like makeup channels or just like channels that have been popular for a long time are like falling off now just because like people are more into like entertainment and like um, Antonio Garza and Emma Chamberlain instead of like beauty gurus except for like the really big ones like James Charles and stuff making me kind of sad because I feel like the like beauty industry is gonna like fall it's gonna take the two glitter shades in this palette and just put them like in the inner corner This is like the similar look that I did for my get ready with me for the quince that I went to. I think that's all I'm going to do and then I'm going to put it in my inner corner and on my brow bone. Oh, I'm really sparkling today. Okay, so I'm pretty much done. This is my batty makeup look, but I'm going to put on some eyelashes. This is obviously optional. I just have really short eyelashes, so... This really won't go with the look. So I'm opening a new pack because I don't have any other ones. <gasps> I just broke my Morphe brush trying to open this. Wow. Okay, let me put that back. The Ardell Wispies for anyone that wants to know. These are like the eyelashes that I use every single makeup look. So with my big craft scissors, I'm going to cut a little bit off because these are way too big for my eye shape. <gasps> no, 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 no. Okay, I don't know what's going on with this eyelash. I think I'm just gonna throw this eyelash away because she's kind of on crack. Hey, so we have discarded her and now she never happened and we're just gonna go on with a new one. Wow, she's glowing. I feel like I always do my eyelashes like too early and then they just slide off. So. Okay, so I put on the first eyelash. These actually look really natural for one. Okay, so I'm looking at some couple drama and it's really interesting. So remind me to never do that again. Okay, so I'm just about done with my baddie makeup. I'm gonna use the Rocket Volume by Maybelline and um, I'm gonna do it on my bottom lashes for like the first time ever. I really hate doing this because it makes me look like goth because it always like rubs down. It's just not cute. Oh my god, what if like my eyelash came off? Ew, like I look scary. Okay, so I just got dressed. And okay, so this is my fit. My shirt just says Internet Girl and it's from Lupsana. And then my pants are from African Mall. And there are these really cool like silver reflective pants. You'll see them later because I'm going to take pictures. But, and then I'm just wearing my filas. And yes, and yes, so this is the fit. Okay, so yeah, that is the look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. This video is actually being sponsored by Poshmark, so thank you, Poshmark. If you've been around for a while, um, they sponsored me like two or three times. If you don't know who they are, they are just an app where you buy and sell, use clothing or use accessories. It's pretty much anything. It's a really good way to like make money as a teenager because as a teenager, you can't get jobs or anything yet. You can sell your clothes that you don't use anymore. Be sure to comment down your handle below so that I could follow you guys and check out what you're selling. Okay, so it's like two hours later. So let's just get on to the things that I'm selling on Poshmark. I'm going to be selling 10 things on Poshmark. So the first thing that I'm selling is this purple like crop top like long sleeve. Um, this is really cute. It's from Lupsana. I'm selling it just because I never wore it. Like it's been in my drawers for like two months and I just never wore it. So this is practically brand new. This next thing I got from Talever and I actually got sent this a while ago and I never wore it. It's actually a two piece set but it'll be sold separately but it'll probably only be like $10 a piece because I don't want to make it like too expensive. It's these white joggers with some red stripes. 
the material isn't that bad you could just tell like it's kind of thin so it probably won't keep you warm but this is really cute if you like like styling joggers like as your fashion style i don't know Never mind. okay it comes with this little hooded sweatshirt the hoodie is right here and it has this little i don't know next thing i got a really long time ago i think i got it in summer i think the shirt is so cute i really like the stripes and like the color pattern on this but it's just like a little bit too small for me and i think like if you have like a good body shape then this would look really good on you because like that's how it looked on me in summer but you know I gained a little weight. Next thing is this basic Forever 21 little sweatshirt. I've had this for so long and I just don't really wear like basic like solid color clothes. I don't know why. I just haven't found myself wearing this. So yeah, I'm going to be selling this. Probably cheap because Forever 21 has pretty like cheap clothes. I'm honestly really sad to be selling this. This is like, they're really popular like fashion wise I guess. I see these everywhere. But I just have too many shirts like this so I thought that I would sell this one. I'm going to be selling this cute little shirt. Next thing is this little striped like reddish pinkish flannel. I bought this like thinking that I was gonna style it but I never did so I just thought I would sell it. This fits probably like a small medium and you could wear this with a tank top. Next thing is this cute little cardigan that I bought on Depop. Um, I tried styling this but I just it's not really in my style. I thought this was really cute because the color pattern is so nice like I was really attracted to it but I just couldn't style this. I thought that this is maybe somebody else's style. I know a lot of people wear cardigans. Honestly really unique. I've never seen anything like quite like that. So I'm going to be selling this striped shirt. It's just a regular basic like cute little like crop top ish kind of shirt. It's like this weird kind of like cutout. Um, a lot of people call it like lettuce cutout and it's just like kind of like roughly if you can see that like. I'm going to be saying this. I got this from Loopsona. I think this is really cute, but it's just not something I would wear. Yeah, so that's everything I'm going to be selling. This is my closet. This is my closet right here, and you could just scroll down, and I'm selling actually a lot more stuff. So, yeah, that's everything that I'm selling. Make sure to comment your handle, and my handle is Desmachati with an I. I don't know why, but it just is. Be sure to download the app Poshmark for free using the link in the description box below. Yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next video.